Biopsy is the most common surgical procedure performed in different specialities of surgery. Most of the biopsies when it is done for purely diagnosis where excision of the tumor is not involved but just diagnosis is involved then it is usually carried out as an OPD procedure. It could be carried out under visual guidance where we see it and then puncture that and take out a small bit of it. We can do it under ultrasound guidance where we use USG and a radiologist pushes a small needle into it and takes out a small piece of the tissue from the uh, area that we want to biopsy or it could also be CT guided. Now these are useful in almost all parts of the body. So most of the biopsies when it is just done for diagnosis is usually a procedure and it is usually done on OPD basis. But when we talk about a brain biopsy, it becomes a surgery in itself. It cannot be done on OPD basis. It cannot be done by a radiologist. It requires a neurosurgeon to do it. Why so? Because the entire procedure involves opening up the skull because without opening the skull we cannot gain access to the brain. So to open up the skull we need to make a burr hole or we need to make a small hole in the skull. So we need to cut the skin, make a hole in the skull and then again the most important thing since nothing is visible directly we need to actually precisely take a biopsy from the site where we need to. So for that we need to use tools which could range from neuro navigation guided procedure to a stereotactic frame to an intraop MRI. So these are the tools which we need inside the OR to help us assisting in doing a diagnostic biopsy. But in most neurosurgical cases the kind of biopsy that we do is called an excision biopsy where we remove a large part of the tumor also along with that. And then we send it for testing and then we know what it is. So the treatment is also done along with that diagnosis is also carried on together. Yes, there are instances where we actually take out a small bit, send it for something called a frozen section inside the operation theater only. So we send it for biopsy, that's called a frozen section and the biopsy report is given in 10 or 15 minutes and then based on what the report is, we can go ahead with the surgery or decide to stop depending on the kind of pathology that we are encountering. So that's it in short about brain biopsy, a procedure which though it sounds like just a biopsy is actually a full-fledged neurosurgical procedure. Thank you.